keeping any edits in sync that you make, or having them be independent. For example, the subtitle track could be used for a translation. Let's make this one a little easier to read. We'll put a background on that one and just expand it a bit like such. There we go. It's good styling. Good. Now let's talk about getting them out. It's possible to embed the captions or the actual burn-in captions here for open, depending upon your choices. Ultimately, we have to get them out for the web. In Premiere, choose which one's visible. For example, I have subtitle visible here. So when I choose File, Export, Media, I can then tell it where I want it to go. I'm going to make a new folder here called To Post. And let's just label this the spot. And we'll do OC for open captions. Now, if you look at this, you can see what happens. We have to decide what to include. So I'm going to, in this case, burn them into the video. And you see it becomes visible. There's no file format here or any other change just enabling them with the on off switch and choosing the burn into video option for the open captions. That's good. I'll click export. And it quickly generates that spot. Now let's export a second time. I'm going to switch to view the 708 captions. 